Uh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I, I'm forgetting where the things are now. I need to go to... No, not there. Um... Hold on a sec here. I gotta find my way around once again. Oh, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. I'm pretty sure I need the fire rod, because I know I can't, like, uh, jump slash at that icy block or whatever it was. Uh, I believe that it was. Or, I, I, it didn't even seem like, seem like an icy block. It seemed like a frozen critter of some sort. I don't know. But, uh, now that I can go up here, I can now... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, how do I get up here now, now that I need the fire rod? Or, was I... Or am I able to get the fire rod somewhere else? I don't know. Hmm. Hold on a sec. Here's a... Oh. Uh, there's a rock's feather. I, I, I don't think I'll even cut that out, even though there's going to be, like, complete silence there. Because I obviously need the rock's feather to, you know, get back to where that spot was. So, there's gotta be a fire rod that I, that I completely missed over there. That I just, like, overlooked because I went way too fast for my own god! Oh my god! <laughs> you fall. Thank you. Awesome. Why didn't I just, like, jump on him from the ground? I don't know, because that would have made this a lot easier. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's just go up. So now that I know... Oh, shoot, I forgot those pots come back. Yeah. Oh, poopers! I was trying to break apart the pots as I went along, because I know that these don't hurt you at all. Now, you, I guess they, you can't call these things spikes, then, because they don't hurt you. Oh, there's a door over here that I completely missed? What is wrong with me? Or, or no, wait, I was here before. So, wait, 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 what, wait, there's a door here? So I missed this door, so then there's probably... Ah, there's a fire rod there. I was just being a complete and total idiot. How did I forget about that door? Ah, so there we go. There's your fire rod. Let's burn this sucker. So I guess it wasn't anything frozen in there. It was just a ice statue of some sort. Hey, let me break these. Thank you. And I will get my... Oh, shoot. Oh, I lost some four stones. That's okay. Oh, okay, what's around here? There is some switches. I can live with that. I'm gonna do the ones further away first. This is not gonna be hard at all, as you can see. And what does this do? It opens that door. Where does this door take us? It takes us to the other side by those bomb shoes. Um, I bet you I need uh, feathers, which are probably behind this door. Yep, just as I thought. That was a pretty good guess, actually. Well, it was more of an educated guess because of the fact that you can't, you know, like, really get there. I should say go back without the... Well, I, well no, like, getting there is the right term because you needed the rock's feather and they probably didn't want to be mean and make you have to go back for your rod. I could jump these gaps, like, so easily. And... Oh, wait, how do you get those? What the poop? That's four squares wide. I can't jump that, can I? Oh, I can jump that. So I guess you can jump squares that are... I mean, uh, jump things that are four squares wide or something? Wait, what was the point of these... Oh, poopers! Ah, I'm taking this way. I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm going back like this. And what was... Seriously, what was the point of coming here? What is that like... Is this supposed to be like a return trip or something? Because I, I don't think I was supposed to be able to do that, honestly. Because I, I just did that, like, perfectly, and I was able to jump the gap. And that's not something that seems like it would be very Zelda-like. Um, what do I do here? Can I, like... Can I yeah! Uh, will that open up something? What if I hit these switches? Nah, that was the wrong one. Oh, that made staff also appear in that room. Um, is this the right... Is this... Am I doing this right? Wait, wh what the heck are you? Uh, oh, well, I guess you're pretty easy to kill. Or, wait, or you just split! Holy poop! Or, or maybe you don't split, and there's just more of them in the room. Oh my god! That was mean! They just ambushed me right on top of my head. And you fall down from above, if you don't mind. That would be kind of nice if you, if you were to do that, so I don't have to jump up there. But I guess you're going to make me jump up there, aren't you? 
and jump slashes are awesome. It always looks epic. Yeah. And there's probably some hearts in here. Ah, uh, hearts and force gems. So all the zones are down here now. And that was it. Uh oh. Woo! It's raining force gems from the heavens. And literally from the heavens, because now it really looks like they're falling, because, well, I shouldn't say that, because they always look like they're falling in other areas. Now, I don't want to get those force gems, because I want to get those up there. Oh, I was going to say before they disappear, but it's too late. I have been too late, and we're still climbing this tower. How many floors is this tower? I don't know, but it's huge. Oh, there's fire rods here. Will this be something that I'll need? Oh, wait, I should... Let's explore the other doors first before I grab that. I probably need, like, oh, I need fire rods to get in that middle door. So, what's the point of these other four rooms, first of all? I don't know. I guess we are about to see. Nothing in this room. Probably, like, supposed to be, like, force gems, like, randomly generated and stuff like that. But that was a pretty poor prize, I have to say. Uh, is there anything in these four rooms besides that middle one there? You know, the four rooms on the outside. Um, because I know that other one contained, yeah, the uh, fire rod. So, nothing. Hm. Well, like, I guess maybe the whole point is so that you can, like, um, I'm, I don't know how to put it, like, get powered up before you go through the store. Like, maybe there's going to be a boss battle coming up. I don't know. I guess we're about to find out, but do I need... Can I, like, get over here with... Yeah, I can get over here with the fire rod. Should I get the Vrox Feather or stick with the fire rod? Probably the fire rod. I think that's going to do the most damage. Um, let's go, like, this, this formation. Yeah! And, okay, that was actually completely... Im I mean, I didn't even need to debate that, because all I did was open this. Oh my god, I'm blocked in. What the heck? I don't know what the heck this thing is. Ah! I guess it's a nest of these creatures. Oh, I can burn these things pretty... Oh, wait, wait. Can I... Does that mean I can do it like this? Like, if I go into... Oh, I was going to say if I go into horizontal formation, but I can't do that in 2D world over here. Um, can I, like... Yeah, I bet you I could burn this eye. Um, at least I think I can. <coughs> um, it closes itself up. When, when you do that, so uh, I'm probably missing something. Let's just take a look in some of these rooms here. Oops. Uh, I don't want to be up here, do I? No, I don't. Wait, what's in this room then? Probably the rock's feather. Oh, the, these guys give you like a ton of uh, health and, uh, you know, rejuvenization items. So I don't think I'm going to die in this uh, level pretty pretty easily. Um, Did I want it? Did I want to do that? Or can I, like, jump up here? No, I can't. Ooh. I bet you I have to go over here first to make a pathway, and then I'll be able to go forward. I guess I'll see. Here's a bunch of switches. And that did make some platforms. Okay, so let's go back. And jump on these. Oof. I said jump on these. It's called the A button, PK Gam. Um, hmm. I bet you I need to kill some of these critters off before I go forward. Because it's it's becoming a freaking invasion over there. Holy cow. Uh, ugh, let's go up here. Because it seems like the last door that I would have to go to. What the heck are you? Hello? Oh, I can, I can hit the force gems out of you. So what are you, like a force gem bouquet or something? Oh, shoot. That was like the root of it or something? Um... Uh, so I guess I can now go over to where he is on the other floor and start sword slashing him. Um, oh wait, no, no, oh, now he's flying. Oh no! Oh, I'm frozen, dang it! Ah! Stop! No, my goodness, they're everywhere! And I will attack you! Ugh! Ugh! Head it, head first attacks! Yeah! Uh, I'm guessing that there, that in his roots, oh wait, that's not, it's not a root, it's something that's holding that critter in. Um, so can I, like, sword slash? Yes, I can. Oh, you're going, you're going down! Oh, head on, to attack! Oh, oh, yeah, you're going down. I bet you're going to go hang up back at the ceiling now, aren't you? Ah! Or you're just going to shoot ice at me to freeze me. I guess that works for you, but not for me. Oh, shoot, I fell. 
Oh, no, 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 I don't think so. I don't think so. Sword Flash! Ooh. Oh, I can't hit... I can't hit your icy shell. Ooh. But I can't hit your eyeball. Yeah, poking your eyeball out with the sword. I gotta say, poking eyes out is like a staple in Zelda games. Do you ever notice that there's like a lot of eyes that you can either shoot with an arrow or you're attacking an eye with your sword? It, it, it's just like a recurring theme of grossness. And you're flying up there, so I can't get you right now, but that might be your whole intent. Uh, oh, I didn't, I didn't mean to do that. Let me out of the icy prison. Okay. This boss isn't really that hard at all. It's just like, it's more like annoying than anything. So, just like keep dodging things. Let's see if I can like go, like sword slash from the top, on top of like Lizard Man up there. Uh, uh, or, or this works. Uh, maybe I'm just supposed to kill Eyeball Man before Lizard Man? I don't know. Well, I killed Eyeball Man. Woo! Ton of Force Gems for the win. And ladders appeared off towards the right side there, and that appeared to be the boss of the area. So that means that the uh, Sky Temple is over. At least it seems like it. Woo! Oh, the barriers! Where would I be without the barriers? Can I, like, go through this? Yeah, some of these electrical fields you can just, like, walk right under, while other ones, you know, they're, they, they, get, they make you take damage. I don't get it. So just avoid the electrical fields altogether and rescue Zelda. All the maidens are freed. Level 7 is done, but there is one more level, and that I'm going to be doing another day. Actually, I should start finishing this game soon, because uh, Kirby's Epic Yarn is coming soon, and uh, I'd like to have some time to play that game, you know, instead of uh, making parts. But I do like making parts, so it's not like uh, time is wasted making parts, so to speak. Uh, I would just like to play some Epic Yarn once it comes out. That would be pretty awesome, I think. Come on, go to my menu screen already. I know you guys can all fit in my pockets because Link has unlimited pocket size. There we go. I can fit six humans, four giant jewels, and a whole load of items into my pocket easily without any questions whatsoever. And force gems. Ooh, this is pretty cool. We're at the, the very top of the tower. Stick 63 force fairies. I got three for this level. That does it for this tower. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.